All right, y'all. What's up, YouTube? <clears throat> Finally got off. First day, wasn't that bad. I actually forgot to ask my trainer how many cases that we did we do today. I asked him tomorrow, but um, not that bad. Really, not that bad. Like, it's definitely overrated, man. I know it's my first day, and we only had 11 stops today. But I mean, for your first day, 11 stops. I mean, put 10 more stops. I got I got another 10 stops in me, man, for real. And like I said, when you get the job, I know you're excited. You know, your adrenaline pumping. Your adrenaline is pumping. And, you know, it can get old fast. I understand all of that. But definitely overrated. Like, everything people have been telling me, uh, or not even people have been telling me, just the videos, the, um, what do you call it? The, back, the backlash, or whatever you call it. People just talking about how hard uh, food service is. How hard food service is. Y'all just lazy, man. I'm just gonna keep it real. Like y'all just lazy. That's all it is. Like we had to dig today. That that part won't fun, of course. But it's not that bad. All you gotta do. Just go ahead and start moving the boxes off the top to find what you're looking for. I mean, it's just simple as that. And as you're doing that, put your um, the stops that you're taking down in order against the wall. Five over here, four over here. That's it. I mean, you, you ain't even got to put it back on the, the thing. I mean, if you got room. We was working out of a 38 today. I know I got a lot to learn, so I'm not going to sit here and act like, you know, it's a cakewalk because... I do feel my feet a little bit, you know what I mean? Like, I get it, it it's, it's work, but it's not, it's overrated what people would be saying. I, I could tell you that right now, and it's my first day. I could tell you that right now, it's really overrated. So, if you wanna make some money, man, and you don't wanna go to food service because of what everybody been saying, don't listen, man. Don't listen, go see for yourself because all it is is getting out the truck and doing it simple as that that's that's all it is and if you drag your feet and you know what i mean like not wanting to do it then of course it's going to be long now tomorrow we got it's going to be a different day we're going to do some hotels where i'm going to be walking a lot more he already told me like some of those um walks that you got to take are like some long walks but you know shout out to my trainer man i'm not really going you know put his name out there or anything like that but great guy you know what I mean? We got the same last name, man. And he, um, he's all what a trainer should be. And I can tell you that in the first day, man. Like, we had our conversation before we even, you know, got to the stop. And I didn't have to, like, really ask much. He, from the time I got in the truck, he started showing me the scanner. Like, anytime I needed to do something with the scanner, he handed it to me for me to do it. Like, how it's supposed to be. Like, I'm telling you. So, when I seen he was doing that, like, you know, he, he was getting his hands dirty. Like, I'm the type, I want to do it by myself so I can feel how it's really going to be. Because that's another thing, too. Like, of course, I didn't feel all the pressure because I got help. You know what I'm saying? I got somebody on the truck doing it with me. You know what I mean? He was, at one point in time, he was loading the dollies up and I was just taking them in the store. You know, he would give me a little walkthrough, show me where everything goes. I was taking them in the store. Then I started getting some practice with the scanner, you know, lowering the dollies. He would take it in the store. And, you know, we were just flipping around like that. So, I mean, I'm loving it, honestly. I'm loving it, man. I just can't, you know, wait to get on my own, of course, because it's a different story when you ain't got somebody there with you. And he was explaining that to me, too. He was like, he trained people that did great with him and they got on their own. It was just a hot mess. And, um, you know, he was, you know, giving me knowledge on that. He was like, it's different when you got somebody here with you because you know that you got somebody, you know, mentally, you know you got somebody there with you. So if you mess up or, you know, being in a tight area, like, I still got a lot to learn. Don't get me wrong with this video, like, but I'm still going to say I'm sticking to it. You know, it's overrated. Like, y'all should stop. Y'all should really stop. If you don't like the job or if you just weak, lazy can't do it just say that you know what i mean it ain't for me but don't try to make everybody else run from it because you can't do it and that's just that's all to it like just because you can't do it you know what i mean everybody else gonna feel the same way 
And, you know, I, I'm preparing my mind, like, already, like, okay, I know when I get on my own, like, the backing he had to do today, yeah, I'm gonna have to get used to that. Like, I won't, I won't do no backing and all that now, so that's another thing that I gotta put in there. <coughs> but it's nothing, man. It's nothing short of trailers. I mean, it's nothing, bro. It's, it's, it's really not. And, um, you know, anybody that's in school right now and you're looking to get your CDL, trying to find a job. Now, a lot of these companies will hire you if they're looking for drivers, but a lot of them won't. So keep that in mind as well, man. Like, you ain't just about to come get a job. Like, it's, it's food service companies that, that are hiring, though, that are hiring people. So, um, yeah, you can you can get a job, but just just know that a lot of people are gonna tell you no. But if you got an opportunity to get into a food service job, do it. Now I haven't got a paycheck yet, so I mean, is it worth the money? I'm gonna say yeah already because everybody that I talk to that's in food service are you know providing the checks, showing showing the, the proof, man, like showing the, the settlements, how much they making, everybody. Everybody knows that um, food service guy, you can make some money. So, with that being said, I'm like, yeah, okay, I'm, I'm kind of excited. I'm not making the full pay, but you know, with a good trainer, by the time I do get by myself, okay, I'm getting full pay. Plus, I should be, you know, up the up to level, a decent level to where I can bust the routes out. Like, you gotta, it takes time. Like, you gotta know what to stack, how to stack it. You know, you know, a couple items we had to look for. We had an extra item on the truck, two extra items on the truck. One was on the wrong truck and one was just extra. And, um, you know, items didn't have stickers on it. So you're gonna, it's gonna be things like we had a, a can of crab meat like roll up under, two cans roll up under like the pallets and we couldn't find them. So we finally, you know, I guess he got experience. He'd been doing it for a while. He looked and he seen them. So we had to fish those out that, you know, that took a good 10 minutes, but like 10 minutes when you're trying to keep moving, that's a long time. So, um, yeah, man, I'm, I'm gonna try to drop a video for y'all like throughout this week, you know, there's it, no way I'm possible that I'm gonna be able to do these videos doing training because, you know, this is a job was, it's a lot, it's a lot of steps and, you know, you got customers you got to go talk to and you know find you just don't have the time to be doing it i mean some people get it done but i'm gonna wait because this is i'm taking this job serious and you know even even when i do you know get on my own if i have the time you see what i'm saying i might take a 30 minute break or something and then drop a video or something like that or you know if we allow go go pros or whatever something like that then you know i might do that or you know you know it's trying to get some time lapse videos or me just coming out of the trailer have this this show that you know what i mean and show y'all a full day of all the stops and what it looks like as far as just coming out the trailer not necessarily going into the store because that's just it's kind of doing too much with this job if you can do it you can do it but i also like you know read stuff seen stuff people saying like you know you don't really want to show the customer too much and the ins and outs of the customer so you know on my channel i'm gonna keep it you know what i mean kind of discreet on how you know i do things but you know if it's if it's opportunity to do it and have a place where i can do it and you know it's just a route that's like that then i do it but i'm definitely gonna keep dropping content and and telling y'all like you know about the food service game and what goes on day to day and you know how to navigate through it you know what i learned i'm, I'm a, um you know give to y'all you know what i mean like i'm there for my subscribers you know how we do like i you know my journey this is my journey and um if you're coming into trucking or you're already trucking and you're thinking about moving to different places i'm gonna give y'all the truth you know what i mean if if i come tomorrow and it's totally different from today i'm not gonna come in here but oh it was a piece of cake I'm, I'm gonna let y'all know how it really was but anyway i just got off so i'm about to get that drive started going home um i'm gonna have to get something to mount in my car so i can talk to y'all on the way home but uh about to get driving 
If you're new to the channel and you like trucking content, go ahead and uh, hit that subscribe button because I've dropped plenty of jewels on you know what I'm learning out here, and I think you really can benefit from it. You know, to all my subscribers, my people that's you know been watching and following, please hit the like button for me, y'all. If you like this video, and uh, drop a comment if you got any questions about anything. You know, I try to get to the comments as they come. Uh, but with that being said, I catch y'all in the next one. Peace.